Well, good morning, folks. Welcome back to Giant's Island. We're going to continue those harvests. The combines are already rolled. We just need to get over there and get this first one unloaded because he has tapped out. Which is great. Put some more in here, but I think that's going to be about full for this guy. Be able to go over and start taking it over to the pig farm and start getting the uh, pig food mixer going. Need some sugar beets though. Probably going to have to uh, hire somebody to come in and harvest those sugar beets. Quite frankly, can't afford to buy a sugar beet harvester. Could lease one. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Have to see how much it is, see how many sugar beets we have floating around this map. Lord knows we don't need that many. I think that's the sugar beet hog field up there. If not the potatoes. Find out soon. Take a look at the map. But first, let's get this guy unloaded. He's cruising a lot, you know. That little tractor, he is sure. Or a tractor, that little combine. And this little tractor, he is sure cruising along. And we are doing nothing but helping the environment. That is what this farm all is for. We're not anything. We are raw. We are definitely environmentally friendly. Hopefully it takes all this. If it does, we're going to have to uh, take it back to the farm. In fact, I'm sure we're going to have to take it back to the farm. Oh, listen to a rumble. This big bad combine. All right, you go ahead and do your thing. 97%, yeah, pretty sure that's not gonna quite cut it. Make sure we go the right way to the farm this time, huh? Who's tired of me going the wrong way? Yeah, me too. I love this old farm home. Oh, it just reminds me of home. <laughs> Bouncing around. Alright. I mean, this is just like... The only the only difference is the pedals actually had... Uh, like a, the grating on them that they've been stamped into them so that they were... Uh, they gripped your, uh, gripped your shoe or your boot. Okay. 15,000 liters. Oh, look, we forgot to put the thing down. Oh, black money. Black gold, should say. And back out to the farm. I have got... Oh, you know what? Dang it, we're going to be stuck here in a minute. We are going to have to go over to the shop. Back. Best ball. Didn't know we hit the best balls. In fact, I'm probably going to have to have them deliver us a truck. I'm trying to get one of them their rain trucks. That's right, I said one of them there. I'm going to leave this guy with the sunflowers. The wheat harvest has been falling a little faster. So, this is 13,000 meters, and I believe the rain trucks are slightly bigger. I'm going to go ahead and do that. So. It's just not good. I mean, it's still belching smoke. Can you stop, please. Oh, thank you. Must have, that's just not. <laughs> Hold, tractor's sick. I'm telling you, it's gonna need some work and some replacement. While that guy's going, uh, let's call up the shop and trucks, 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 trucks. I can never find the trucks because they're usually staring at me. We are gonna go. We're gonna go old school. We're just gonna go with that little guy. No. Let's see, the International Harvester here is $20,000, and it is 30,000 liters. I'd love that truck. That'd be great. It's actually smaller, uh, but that would be a really nice truck. The 100, yeah, that's not going to fly. Where's my other one? Oh, I passed it. Ah. This one's got, this one's slightly smaller, it's only 20,000 liters. 
but uh, but it costs half as much. So I think we're going to get the old used Chevy C70. Go ahead, no upgrades, basic standard truck. We're going to buy that guy, and I'm going to go ahead and uh, have the shop bring that over. See you guys back at the wheat field. All right. We are back with our Chevy C70. And it doesn't appear that he's ready for us just yet. So we're going to go ahead. Oh, that's a nice sound. That is excellent. That is really quite nice. Tinted glass. Smoked glass. Love it. So he's still cruising along. I think we're going to need to get... What have we got cultivated here so far? Fertilized cultivated I swear oh field 16 we're gonna take our Oliver here which if I'm not mistaken he's up one over here get the Oliver and we're gonna take him over to field 16 and we're gonna get him get him to fountain planting I should put the plant next. We plant more wheat? We did soybeans. Looks like Helper Joyce is getting close. Oh, what to plant, what to plant? Ah, canola. We'll plant canola. I haven't heard of harvested any canola yet. This does canola, yes, this does canola. right along. Field 16 is just off to the right. Okay, I'm going to get it right this time. It's going to be fantastic. I'm going to go the proper direction to the proper field for the first time. Are you amazed? So am I. Of course, this is the way I always want to go, so it's not shocking that I actually end up going this way. So. Of the wheel slippage. All right, let's see here edit this out. Uh, no, 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 no. By fertilizer, by seed. We'll let him go. Oh, so sorry, so sorry. We gotta get back over to our truck. All right. Can we catch it? Can we catch it? Uh, yeah, Joyce is gonna have to wait. I'm gonna try and catch this guy. Hey, can you, can you, whoa, settle down, settle down, settle down. Can I block you? There we go. Oh, and that's perfect. Not too tall. The old truck. I love this old truck. This is the way I grew up. Animation slightly off on the truck. But I still like it. Oh, I'm so sorry. So sorry. So sorry. All right. Let's go get our farm all. Get it over there. Good choice, because she was like, she's a worker. So proud of her. That's that bad boy filled again. We might fill this trailer one more time off this field, which would be fantastic. All right. Another 2,800 liters. There we go. Rolling it in there. Hot dog. F-15. Come on, baby. This is a cool heat combine. I can't wait to upgrade it. Maybe like a Russell Mash? No, not the Russell Mash. I haven't seen one of those in the States here. Nobody saw me go through that tire. That didn't happen. There was obviously a collision there. 
no way that that happened actually that that just happened all right you get to it so we have got oh yes I wanted to get a new car a new tractor I wanted to get a tractor to cart with but for right now we're gonna have to take this guy we're gonna go back and we're gonna get the baler and start getting that straw bailed up again that's a lot of straw we got bailed pigs are gonna be nice and cozy that's a doggone shirt who's this bad boy I'm back there I know it's super fast we'll get you there quick I'm just curious if any of you guys you know that watch this have any suggestions on what to plant or what you'd like to see planted, please go ahead and, you know, let me know in the comment section. Or if you, uh, I think that I'm lost on my own farm. Alright, let's see here. Ah, there we are. Four of you. Want to give me any of the suggestions? Those are always welcome, and I'm in the wrong barn. I love me. Especially when I don't know what I'm doing. Aha! Found the big boy. Now, I'm pretty sure I had this on the Oliver last time because of the power requirements. Well, let's hope we can get it done with this guy. There we go. Am I going the right direction? Am I heading towards my fields? No, I'm heading away from my fields. You know, they really need to have, like, you know, signs out here for me so I can figure out which way it is I'm going. Because I really obviously don't know. Go ahead and get that unfolded while we're moving on over there. It's got a little hay in it. We'll turn that into straw real quick. Get the pickup lower down. And let's get cruising. Ah, yeah, see. The power issue. The tractor's not quite as strong as the other one. She is working. But it is going... Oh! I don't know, maybe I mentioned this last time, but the PTO in this works, and that is really cool. We, uh... I'm going to probably take one of my youngest ones to the World Dairy Expo that happens at the... at our Coliseum here in, uh, here in town. I had them over there the other day. We got tickets for a Disney show on ice or something like that. It was something my wife wants to take the kids to see. And, uh, excuse me. Dog on the we, uh, we were there and they had a bunch of equipment already out. They've got a new Holland Center there as well. Uh, but they had uh, a, coon, a couple of coon manure spreaders, balers, you know, some different equipment, feed mixers, and he just thought that was neat to go and see the big tractors, and, 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 or not the big tractors, the big equipment, go get the side of it and check it all out. The, uh, the only one tractor they had was like a T6, um, so it wasn't a super big tractor, but he thought that was pretty cool, got to see that. The big spinners for the, the, the kick out the manure, he thought those were, were something got up in there, got to stand next to him, got to screw, you know, they actually spin quite freely. So, he was, uh, he was impressed. He had fun, but uh, there's going to be the World Dairy Expo, so they have the, the cattle in there and everything, and everything else, and I remember we had him at, a uh, at a fair here last year, I didn't get one this year, really got a uh, bummer, like, you know, derby, but, uh, he, uh, he loved the cows. Oh man, we can grow the cows. So we're gonna try and get back to um, try to get him over there so we can see the cows and enjoy that because that was just his thing. Really did love that. Am I gonna beat this guy? He's gonna be cool. He's winning. I'm doing four miles an hour, well that's why. I'm gonna have to switch the Oliver. So I think it's got another 20 or 30 horsepower, which is quite frankly a big difference. This guy's just fighting it. It's getting there, but it's fighting it. Just curious here. Let's see here. It's turned around, and I'm curious. What horsepower difference is this? 
What's the garage say? The garage says we have... This one is... Come on, 90 horse... Oh, no, 120... That's 122 horsepower. This requires 135, so it's only 1,300 horsepower under. This is... That's 160 horsepower. Ah, that explains it. Quite a bit more powerful. As you can see, it makes one heck of a difference. I don't think the other one would slow down like this. We'll find out soon enough, because... Marn, she's going to you know, need to have her empty out. I'll probably just have her pull over to it, rather than me going over there and busting a bit of the tractor. Moving the moving out. Trailer around. Just have her empty it when she gets over there. Hopefully we can clear this header and it doesn't have an issue. Here we come. Meet our friend here. Working this wheat if we ever get there. Oh, baby. Not moving very fast. Right on by. Not a problem. That's it. Look at that. That is excellent. Excellent for the environment. Glad I parked over there. Shouldn't get in my own way. Oh, we're skipping every... We're skipping every other one. Our has a full grain tank. Let me... You know what? Turned around, and I'm gonna hop out and give her a call and have her just dump it herself because there's no reason for me to go over there. Hang on just a second. Couldn't hardly hear, I had to shut the tractor down. Alright, so she's out that empty, and she looks like she's just about done with the field. Hopefully, get that wrapped up here in just a second. Get this bad boy on down there. Bales all popped out. And I know watching me bale, me load the bales was like a great, thrilling, exciting thing on the time lapse. If you guys watched that one a few episodes back. Uh, quite frankly, I, I hated it. I was ready to pull out my my hair. What little I have left, which is not much. Yeah, it, it kind of started going. Wife, kids, things of that nature kind of started just yanking it out of my head. Well, I slept apparently. But, uh. Is that the Oliver? I have sure I'll just come over here with the Oliver. Whoa! What happened with that? You can see that just threw in the bail. I did not like that the way it's in there. Strange. We'll huff this thing back to the top. I don't have any other fields cultivated. I've only got the other one harvest. I'm going to get the, the, the cultivator on this one. Drag the cultivator over there. We will uh, leave this guy here at the top of the field. Bring the Oliver back. Leave the cedar over there because it. Uh, after, after that over there anyway. Hopefully get into that today. So we will take this, shut this guy down. And let's go see if sure it is the one who I think it is. See now this has no problem going downhill. Why it's still belching by smoke I don't know. There we go. We're environmentally friendly. Get all that we all that wheat or barley to harvest as well, which is gonna be just poor straw. We will have no problem taking care of our animals. Once we have money to take care of them with. To purchase them to take care of them. So let's see. Shura, are you who I think you are? You are. Oh, 
not the cultivator. Oh dear. That's a problem, folks. <laughs> there ain't no coming back from that. Shut that down before we have a problem. Okay, well, you know, I think that might be a problem. Hey, Shura! You know what? Why don't you just go on home? I'm going to take the tractor, and I'm going to see if I can't bump that farm all back over. Not exactly what you're supposed to do. Kind of hard on the tractors. All right. <laughs> and boom. Nope. Okay. Lots of stuff. such a bummer. I've got no way of flipping that because it's got the end loader. So let's we're going to have to go do this even though I hate doing this. No, that's not what I want to do. So we'll get this guy run back over here. And we will Get it hooked up to the baler. We'll get it moving along. I can't believe it. Nah. Some flower. That, that just does not have a big enough hopper. Like a half the hopper this one does. I thought I had a bigger hopper. That's the only irritating thing about this. This just doesn't have the hopper. We'll see how this guy does going up these hills. I'm pretty sure this track is going to have a lot, a lot easier time. Alright, before I get this started, hire a worker. Okay, so I've got this. This person is ready to rumble. Where did I put the cultivator at? There you are. Get you lined up here. Okay. Go. Try not to hit the back of the building. Which field is harvested? Which field? So, so we're just about done. So 26. 26 is the big one. We'll take this over field 26. Which is right. Right? Right. Yeah, it's right here. Okay. We'll have it run some circles around this bad boy. Start right here. Beautiful. All right, so I had help going, going around in circles. There we go. This field is four acres. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, so apparently that's wrong. Let's try it again. Nope, nope, that is wrong as well. Thank you very much. Does not like starting here on this end. Back her on up to here. Try this one more time. I know it should be this way. Figure it out. There we go. That's better. Oh, cruise it now. Let's do it. Go, 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 go. In the corner. Nice. 
catch up to the truck, and I will take the truck back over and get that trailer going again. It's doing all right. Doing all right. In fact, I probably need to check on the combine over there in the sunflower. She, yep, she flat out quick gone home. That guy hopped in the wrong doggone vehicle. Got our truck fired up here. Here we go. Yippee ki -yay. Staring on this, I do not like that much. Where did you go? Are you just hanging out back there? So over here, I might as well bring it the trailer. Apparently, I don't know how to back the tra truck up. That's okay. I'm coming. Now, why did you go home? Please tell me. I, I am curious. This makes no sense to me. You're not full. Absolutely no sense whatsoever. That is not a straight. Let's just irritate. I want to cut through the grass here. Nice, lovely little trees. Weeping willows, if I look the right way. Wait a minute here. Look the right way. Let's go home. There's a the farm. Head over there. Baylor going again. Coming through, folks. And you, are you full yet? What's your deal? Where'd you go? Oh, you had a brain conniption fit, I see. You didn't like that into the field for some reason. I tell you, these workers couldn't have finished anyway, but still. I mean, seriously. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Just a sad didn't like that into the field. Alright. This thing's impossible without the mirrors. This is why we bought old used equipment. In case we need to get a car out of it. Oh, this thing's brakes are bad. We need to be fixed. There we go. Pretty much gonna fill that truck. Get out on close. That oh, that's even got a pintle hitch. I didn't know that. Oh, that's terrific. Now, what was your major malfunction with this over here? Wrong? Is it ugly weed? Oh, wait, no. No, it just refuses. Alright, we're gonna take this ourselves. We'll just finish this part of this bit of the field out ourselves, because that's just strange. It does not like that. I don't know why, but we'll take it. It's not going to be that much, but we're pinching pennies here. I mean, there's $70,000 in the hole, and all our equipment needs to be replaced already. Because it's so flipping old. But I think we're going to make some progress here real soon. I mean, we're seven episodes in. We've got a fair bit of equipment. Just we've gotta, gotta get it brought back up to I don't know the nineteen eighties, nineteen nineties. That would be really great.
right. Last little bit. Can I hire you now? Sure can. So you know, Billy. Make sure it finishes this. Get the technical straight. It's kind of wobbly. I think that's an FGPS. It's a little too old for that upgrade. Once it finishes this, I'm going to throw it over on that other field up there. Oh, you, are you serious? Okay, come on now. Let's go. Finish that off. Actually, more wheat here than I thought it was going to be. There were a thousand liters. I didn't think there'd be anywhere near that much. Oh, Sanja! Can you get that field finished out, Sanja? That'd be really great. Alright, we will empty this out. I'm not sure if that's wheat or barley over there. I would hate to have to come on back and empty this out or drive the truck over there just because this thing's being, having to switch crops. Back up! Holy bad brakes. Now we're going to rip it up. We are going to get over there in a heartbeat. No, we're not really, but that's nice. We're going to hop in the truck here. Follow on over. Can you keep up? That's a joke, folks. Here we go. Oh, we are cruising now. Here comes the truck. Broom. Absolutely broom. Now let's find out. Hopefully it's barley. I'd like to have a little balance here. That would be, be nice. We've done wheat twice, three times. Pretty sure we got another field of wheat. Man, this thing's really box in over here. Alright. What is that? Soybeans! Oh, even better! Soybeans! Oh, that's beautiful. For one, that means no bailing. Okay, you can go ahead and let that go. We're gonna... We're going to drive down here. We're going to catch it down at the end and get it turned up. If not mistaken, yeah, that should be fine. Soybeans. Oh, beautiful soybeans. They even look like soybeans. It's not perfect, but that's doggone close. I'll take it from here, thank you. All right. This, this should be able to run this whole, I bet this runs this whole field before it kills that hopper. Because this wasn't fertilized. Just doesn't quite have the power that I'd like it to have. Alright, you go ahead and do that. We're going to run over here and check out. No, I'm heading the wrong way again. Not checking nothing out. And I hope Sanja gets those sunflowers done. We're going to go over and try to get that bailing wrapped up for today. That would be really nice if I could get that done. It's a good thing we have a truck that goes way too fast, huh? Nobody around. Look at those beautiful fields that be harvested. All right, here we go. You here, sir. We'll get you emptied next time. I get that pig food mixer rolling. Probably take the it and the gravity fed wagon over. Get that done. So we know this is going to have no problem going downhill. The other truck had obviously no problem going downhill. Let's see what it does going uphill. That's the key. The other one will work five miles an hour at most. This one does at least 
man. This is our new traveler. I will be changing. I know with the uh, 
upcoming DLC, we'll be doing some different things. Switching, uh, switching other farms up. I got an idea. We'll draw all the farms we're probably going to leave Giants Island and head on over to a multi, uh, uh, a variety of different things on uh, another map where if mining and construction, I've downloaded a bunch of equipment for that to be able to get after that and really get in there work. I've got some good equipment size wise and versatility working that so we will uh will it be eventually leaving that more likely when we go down to Argentina as well for our sugar cane harvesting I'm excited about that different equipment totally different crop something that's never never been in a farm simulator I mean they you can find guys who've done maps where they've got uh, cotton on the map find download a cotton harvest which I have because I was planning on doing that but thinking that the uh, the uh, uh, brain cramp and the mining ones would be more interesting than the boy we've got cotton. Um, let's see if cotton is grown in Argentina. Not that it'd be on the map, that's all the bummer. But uh, yeah you can get it get a variety of different things going on there. Almost got this thing. So we'll wrap, wrap this field up. In fact, there goes off my timer. So we'll wrap this field up, get that last little bit harvested, and we'll just see you guys the next time. Or hopefully, we get a variety of different things going on here too. It's a busy farm right now. This is a way we are. We've got a harvester going. We've actually got two harvesters going. We've got a cultivator going. We've got this guy going. We're gonna be getting into the animals. We're gonna be busy. Very busy. We've gotta get some sheep. Get some wool going. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, leave me a comment, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, leave me a comment, give me a thumbs down. But as always, I'm Lord Thunder Monkey, and we will see you guys next time.